if by any chance you know the military was not there we would be having you know some other kinds of uh, uh, situation right here in the in the country so what's the latest on the vaccination and what kind of uh, plans do you have in order you know get everybody vaccinated is the <coughs> ultimate goal yeah of course you know that in sri lanka his excellency the president uh, initially informed me one of the leaders were leaders who informed that vaccination is uh, one requirement for us to get rid of or to come out of this situation so with that uh, his excellency the president and the government of sri lanka appointed the uh, committee uh, task force uh, to get the vaccines mm -hmm. and to have the system going so uh, as of now to cut a long story short yes uh, we have already uh, you know that uh, we have brought uh, uh, something like 23 million point 3 uh, doses to sri lanka you know our population is also a close about 22 million, to, uh, 22 million. Yeah. so we have brought 23.3 million already to back to sri lanka and also out of that the most importantly we have vaccinated 7.17 million with both doses 7.17 million with both doses mean almost uh, it is like uh, something like 62.39% uh, of the population. of the population above the age of 30 uh, is been already vaccinated the 62% above the 30 uh, is a, f a good number that we have vaccinated so uh, now Uh, we had a strategy yes we are going to vaccinate uh, above the age group of 30 uh, so we have uh, indicated time to time that we will be bringing uh, vaccines and we gave st targets uh, okay by 50% will be brought uh, vaccinated by uh, august 15 and already uh, according to now we have brought five types of vaccines and uh, we have managed to get this uh, 7.1 million uh, with to both doses so our target was about about 30 population something like 11.5 million uh, population was targeted and uh, we mentioned that by second week third week we should be able to vaccinate the entire population this was announced so i think we are going ahead with the same thing and uh, we can uh, Uh, as as of today we can think that most likely by third week we should be able to vaccinate the entire population under under 30 years old about 30, 30 years uh, age so that is why i said we are at 62.39 yeah. at this moment about the 30 group but uh, when it comes to uh, the total population as of now it is there but the fact remain that uh, by september mid september they are after we have another population within our population about 3.5 3.3 million uh, uh, population between the age group of 18 to 30 so that is there and also below 18 also uh, 12 to 18 we have another 3.5 million so that population is also there so are you are you uh, hoping to vaccinate them as well uh, yes now it is like this during the uh, last covid meeting headed by the secretary of the president president informed the health specialist who were at the meeting and also the health minister and everyone informed that uh, to advise as to whether we should go for the third dose or the booster yeah. first and go for the uh, below 30 category or whether it should be the below uh, 30 18 to 30 group should be vaccinated first so i am sure that the health specialist after analyzing the entire situation will come forward with their solution or whatever the recommendation there after his excellency president will decide especially i have to mention that uh, now i was mentioning about the present situation and the vaccination in regard to uh, the deaths occurred 8775 as of now we did a analysis of the uh, third wave that is 8141 mm. out of that 75% of the population who had died are the age group about age of 60 yes okay and between the age group 30 to 60 deaths are something like 24% meaning to say that 99% of our population uh, out of who had died of covid 19 99% are 
अबाउ द एज ग्रुप ऑफ थर्टी अबाउ द थर्टी ओके सो ओनली वन पर्सन इज द बिलो थर्टी सो देर फॉर यू कैन अंडरस्टैंड पीपल कैन टॉक अबाउट दू आर आस्किंग अबाउट द क्रिटिसिजम एंड थिंग्स लाइक दैट नाउ स्ट्रैटी वर्स अबाउ द थर्टी सो सो फार वी हैव मैनेज टू डू दिस एंड दैट इज द रीजन द प्रोसीडेंट वॉन्टेड एंड द टास्क फोर्स एंड द गवर्नमेंट वॉन्टेड दैट द अबाव एज ग्रुप थर्टी टू बी वैक्सीनेटेड फर्स्ट सो दे आर बाई नाउ यू अंडरस्टैंड दी इज द मोस्ट वॉलनरेबल ग्रुप Yeah. So you ask the question whether you have to come below yeah, or exactly. go for the third boost. Now all these things has to be considered when we are going for the third. And and you are actually you know thinking about that and and steps will be taken. Yeah, that is what I, I mentioned. You very important to understand. Ninety nine percent is mm. about the age group of thirty. We had a strategy. We had a strategy. That is why it's like that. That is the reason. Now vaccination. We are talking of vaccination. That is why we started off the vaccination program, and uh, it was. didn't have the momentum that we expected therefore with the to support the health authorities even the military was called on the vaccination program and we have yeah, gone yeah. according so as of now uh, because of this situation which i mentioned about the percentages uh, this is according to the figures so that is why once again about a month back we focus the age group about the 60 and started off with the vaccine because i told 75% is them so therefore we started off a program like that then there after when we felt that some are still not coming the military started off along with health especially kalamo municipal council and other places we started off going through mobile vaccination program where people go to house to house and do the vaccination so thereby we have managed to do that as well so as you know that it's almost 99% to close upon to 100% first vaccination be done yeah. and uh, this is a quite a number with the yeah, second yeah. dose as well